Welcome back to the Hounds Hideaway News. I am Julian Spivey. For tonight's top story, our annual Halloween photo booth will be taking place on Monday, October 30th and Tuesday, October 31st. The price is $10 per dog and costumes are welcome. We will add an additional $5 if the pup's costume has more than two pieces to put on, and an additional $25 if their head spins around and they spit up pea soup. It's happened before. To sign up, comment on the post on the Facebook Pet Parents page, or scan the QR code at our daycare pickup line gate. The Hounds Hideaway Pet Parents Association take such good care of us pack leaders and employees that we felt it was time to repay the favor by throwing a PPA doggy brunch. Wait, that makes it sound like we're going to be eating dogs. Uh, we're not going to be eating dogs. Uh, anyway, the PPA brunch will be Saturday, November 4th at 10.30 a.m., so mark your calendars now. You'll definitely want to be there because we're going to have a fall photo booth, though there is nothing funny about dogs falling and we will be debuting some of our custom Christmas merch that you're, you know you're going to want to buy. Uh, the PPA is a great way to meet more pet parents and do more fun Hounds Hideaway activities. Uh, so if you have any questions about the PPA, please ask Lacey Vance, Haley Mannion, Emily Roberts, Emily Bundrick, Bree Archer, uh, literally anybody but me. Congratulations to our October Dog of the Month. Biscuit Cook. Biscuit recently turned 17 years old, so we figured we might as well do it while we can. Our very own Hannah Rodriguez is helping us to celebrate Dia de los... White guy problems. <sighs> Our very own Hannah Rodriguez is helping us celebrate Dia de los Muertos by setting up an ofrenda or altar to help us celebrate our loved ones who have crossed the Rainbow Bridge. The ofrenda will be on display in the Hounds Hideaway lobby from October 30th through November 3rd, inviting our lost loved fur babies back for a couple days of remembrance and celebration. It is believed by doing our offerings will guide the souls back to earth and keep the spirit of our loved ones alive. If you would like to have your loved one's picture included, there is a Google form attached to our post that is pinned at the top of the Pet Parents Facebook page. So uh, submit it there, or you can bring your own photo into our lobby. If you do that, please write your full name on the back so we know who to return it to. Uh, thank you so much, Hannah and Maya, Meg, Old Lady, Ryder, Copper, Kimber, June, Darla, and so many others. I can't wait to have you with us again. The first Hounds Hideaway hike in a long time will be taking place on Saturday, November 18th, which coincidentally is one day after National Hiking Day. The time and place are to be determined, but my fat dog and I will be on our couch. You fit people with your labs and retrievers, y'all go on and enjoy yourselves. Stay tuned to the Hounds Hideaway Pet Parents Facebook page for that time and place. And everybody is welcome. The old hideaway gang is at it again. The hideaway bandits, which are Beagle Roscoe Rice and Shepherd Mix Coam Wilson, have perpetrated another theft on an unsuspecting Hounds Hideaway employee. The two-dog operation works with Coam feigning interest in a pack leader and knocking his wallet out of their back pocket while Roscoe comes around and scoops it up. We recently caught the bandits in action. Please do not look over the fence into the Bigs outdoor yard as it riles up the pack who are used to only our beautiful faces, and not the rest of you uggos. We have recently... There's a cat butt in my screen. Simba. There's a cat butt in my screen. 
what are we going to do about this? We have recently created a Hounds Hideaway YouTube page. So if you like to see our cute, funny, or just plain dumb videos involving our pack leaders and your dogs, follow us over at YouTube at Hounds Hideaway. Seriously, the cat butt was in the screen the entire time.